Everybody knows about Wikipedia, but what you might not know about are the other projects run by the same foundation. This p in support of the Wikimedia Foundation, we need to talk about Wikipedia's sister, Wikimedia Commons. One of the most important parts of the social order is interaction with art. It's important to view, but it's also vital to be able to use, edit, remix, and build upon. The world is better with free creative assets in it, and Wikimedia Commons provides them. Every image in this video has been taken directly from Wikimedia Commons. The music playing right now is from Wikimedia Commons. Even this high-definition stock video of a walrus was made freely available by its creator and hosted on Wikimedia Commons for us to use. Providing impoverished people the same publishing powers as those privileged enough to buy proprietary assets is a positive pursuit. Allowing everybody access to a large library of creative assets expands online conversation and empowers the ideas of marginalized groups to compete on a more level playing field with the content emerging from existing power structures. Video essays like this allow for nuanced discourse on niche topics, but require heaps of content to produce. Sourcing this material is incredibly costly. Even cheap subscription options are too expensive for many people who would like to have their voices heard. This leads to people resorting to relying on the fair use doctrine which can lead to demonetization, video takedowns, and increased marginalization as people are removed from the discussion. While the world has gotten better on average for the last century, the world of copyright has only gotten worse for its creators. As corporations cling with avarice to the intellectual properties of artists long dead, Wikimedia Commons serves the victims of this corporate greed by cataloging and hosting over 90 million media files, all free of charge. So donate to the Wikimedia Foundation today. For the commons, if you can't do it with your money, then consider doing it with your media. For more examples of how their library can be used to educate people, check out my previous videos, almost entirely sourced from Wikimedia Commons. Oh, and by the way, don't forget to be awesome.